Hi there. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will be comparing Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are two car operating systems that allow you to take advantage of the vehicle's touch screen when your cell phone is connected. Both give you the possibility to control different functions from a single point, to make your driving safer and more technological. Which one is better? Well, take a look at this comparison of Apple CarPlay with Android Auto and draw your conclusions. Both Google and Apple have developed several effective solutions for anyone who likes to make use of technology while driving their car freely. However, both operating systems have several distinct differences that you should take into account before choosing one over the other. We bring you the definitive comparison between Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. So if you wanted to know how these two platforms differ, then you've come to the right place. Android Auto users have constantly complained that the software crashes or disconnects while navigating or listening to music. This is an inconvenience that many people have reported and whose solution is still unclear as the reasons why Android Auto randomly crashes are unknown. CarePlay, on the other hand, does not generate this problem and users are happy with its stability. Conceptually this makes sense as Apple's software is developed and tested for a small set of phones created by the same company. Because of this. Here it could be said that Apple's platform has an advantage over Google's platform. However, the experience may vary depending on the make and model of the phone you're using Android Auto with. CarePlay is a software that follows the same design philosophy as iOS and ends up standing out in this aspect over Google's platform. While Android Auto is perfectly functional, it does not have the same level of polish. In addition, CarePlay also supports more customization of its look and feel that can be changed from the home screen itself, an Apple experience through your car's screen. Siri was born when the iPhone 4S hit the market and has remained a solid voice assistant ever since. However, Google Assistant has a clear technological and performance advantage with Android Auto. Why? Because it's smarter, has more features and will understand you more often than Siri. Apple, aware of this, is working hard to catch up with Siri. However, in this 2022 Google has a better voice assistant. So if this aspect is important to you, it may be the best option for you to use Google Assistant while driving to your destination. At this time, only a small number of messaging apps work with CarePlay. This number has been reduced due to Telegram's removal from CarePlay, so now it seems that WhatsApp is the only messaging app that offers support for the Apple-developed car operating system. As you must be imagining, Android Auto is a better platform for messaging apps than CarePlay. If you communicate through a tool other than WhatsApp, then CarePlay is not the best choice for you or your car. Let's be objective. Both CarePlay and Android Auto allow you to use whatever music or navigation apps you fancy. That is, you don't have to use Apple Maps with CarePlay if you don't want to since you can swap it for another tool of your liking. However, it is quite true that some apps like Google Maps work a bit better on Android Auto because it offers touch interface options that are slightly better. In conclusion, the level of support offered to the applications is more or less the same. Mind you. Here we leave aside the messaging apps mentioned above as this needs a separate discussion. Be that as it may, both operating systems support a good number of apps that make your life easier. Making and receiving calls, without a doubt, is one of the most important functions for Android Auto and CarePlay users. In this aspect, there is not much to compare, as both voice assistants can make and receive calls perfectly well. Call completion sound clarity, and connection performance are virtually the same. In short, both Android Auto and CarePlay have what you need to talk quietly while driving to any destination. When you use Google Maps or Waze, Android Auto allows you to scroll and explore the rest of the route as you do on your mobile. In CarePlay, things are not as intuitive because you have to use arrow keys to move the map, which is dangerous and contradictory when driving. In Android Auto you can slide your finger across the screen to explore the map and taking an alternative route is as easy as tapping the one highlighted in grey. To summarize, Android Auto has an advantage over CarePlay when it comes to exploring the map or finding alternate routes while driving. 
CarePlay and Android Auto can work wirelessly, but some manufacturers or models do not support Android Auto wireless, while they work perfectly with CarePlay. Also, when connected wirelessly, some Android devices tend to heat up during long trips, which is rarely the case with an iPhone. And finally, Android Auto also consumes more battery when used wirelessly compared to CarePlay. Here ends our comparison on Apple CarePlay and Android Auto. We hope you find it very useful. If you have any suggestion kindly share with us in the comments section. Also, do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Please click on the notification bell in front of the subscribe button to turn on notification for this channel, so as to notify you when I post new video. Thank you for watching.